vocal compression can sound way better when using multiple compressors instead of just one. First, grab a compressor with a really fast attack and a fast release time like the 1176 compressor. The goal with this compressor is to only compress down these quick and sudden peaks in your vocal. I like using an 8 to 1 ratio to do this. How much gain reduction you want on the first compressor is very dependent on the vocal recording and how drastic these peaks are, but 3 to 5 decibels is a good starting point for me. Next, I like to use another compressor directly after the 1176 to compress the overall vocal. The LA-2A is great for this as it has a very gentle and smooth release. Since we handled the peaks with our first compressor, we have a more compact and consistent vocal signal to feed into this second compressor. Next, dial in some gain reduction and how much gain reduction is very dependent on the vocal recording and the sound that you're going for. So for the second compressor, I'm gonna aim for around five decibels of compression. Building me up and then you're tearing me down Screaming I don't think I'll last any longer 